Okay. So we stayed in <laughs> yes. this week and we watched The Vow, which was disappointing. Yeah, it was really bad. We uh, were both so excited for high, this high movie hopes. and we never got to see it in the theaters and it was just awful. And yeah. I'm so glad we didn't get to see it in the theaters because I think we would have been even more disappointed. Oh my gosh. So terrible. Let's re- recap, I guess. Yes. Okay. All right. I love you. I love you. I'm sorry, who are you again? What? And, and scene. That's, that was it. Yeah. If you really want to get a gist for the movie, just watch the trailer. Oh, the trailer is so good. It's, it's so beautiful. much better than the movie. Yeah, absolutely. Did you have a favorite moment? Uh, yeah. I, my favorite part of this is really just the concept. I really like the idea of this, which is Rachel McAdams loses her memory. She's married to Channing Tatum and... No, that's right. <laughs> and uh, then she, they get in a car accident, and she doesn't really know who she is. She loses eight years of her life. So I love this concept of what would you do if you wake up and you yeah. don't know who you are? Will you be who you were, or will you go back to who you were before you changed? So She I, does both. <laughs> yeah, it's just a really fascinating, and it's actually based on a true story, but it was kind of wrapped in a rom-com and very surface, so it's a very interesting concept that they didn't do a lot it's with. It's just boring. It's a boring movie. Yeah. It's really boring. Yeah. How about you? Uh, there's a point in the middle of the movie where he turns to one of his friends and he's like, I gotta make my wife fall in love with me again. And I was like, now the movie has begun. And it's an hour and ten minutes into it. Like, it was just, the pacing, it was just weird. You could have saved us all a lot of time. Oh my gosh, so much time. We could have been watching Twilight. Oh. <laughs> One through four. <laughs> Whatever. Uh, how about you for least favorite? Yeah, my least favorite is that Nicholas Sparks didn't jump on this boat because this is like a perfect for him and I think he could have made this movie so much better. Like I just wish he would have taken initiative and gotten it done. Written this. Written it, directed it, done everything, made a cameo, everything. Just had him involved. Yeah, he needed, he needs to hug this project. What about you? Uh, my least favorite is that uh, this movie starts off with a car accident. Yeah. And I think from the preview, we kind of thought it was going to be, you got attached to the characters, yeah. you found about, oh, like you watched their love, and then the car accident happens, and you're like, oh no. Yeah, we just didn't care. You yeah, just didn't care instead you're not invested, it starts off with that, and you're just kind of like, I don't know, stay together, don't stay together. Yeah, do whatever you want. Lose, keep your memory gone. Yeah. Erase my memory of this. Mm-hmm. That's what I want. Yes. Ugh. Cameo? Yeah, uh, he has an awkward... I can't... I'm scared to say his name because I always... I don't... It goes together so awkwardly. Yeah. Channing Tatum. Has a best friend who's just so awkward, as awkward as his name, in this movie. And he's just like, I'm wearing an awkward hat. I'm wearing... A, he's just always there being weird. And I just thought he was funny. Yeah. Crazy best friends. Yeah. I love, I love him. Yeah. Uh, waka waka. <laughs> cool. uh, I'm going to give my cameo to Channing's chest, which oh. makes an appearance as it should. Uh, yeah. That's really all he's good for. I think that was my favorite part of when he hosted SNL, that every sketch they were like, just take your shirt off. <laughs> if you could just more work a, around your chest. More that of a will feature be, than a cameo. It really, really, yeah. It just it helps us not focus on his acting or yeah. the lack thereof. It's really, it's a smart move for him to just let us see this area. Yeah, and I'm glad he did, too. Let's objectify him. Kept me engaged. Very engaged. Yeah, yeah a tight-fitting shirt. Well done. Yeah, A+. Plus. Mm-hmm. Ryan? Ryan? Oh, I, you know, I thought it was, I thought it was okay. Mm. Nice. Okay. What would you rate this? I would rate this, this is just a movie, background movie, background noise movie to turn on, watch it, don't watch it, it's mm. there, it's not there. Yeah. Not going to change your life. I would say see it on a plane or a background movie. Either one, really. It's just kind of, it's just there. It's a perfect way of saying it. Yeah. All right. right. And And scene. scene.